Hi guys, welcome back. So I have a special guest here today. I'm really, really excited for this video too. It's my friend Doug. Hi. He, he is a hairstylist and also a drag queen. And he's really young and really, really talented. And um, he's gonna turn me into a drag queen today. A woman. Yeah. A heterosexual biological woman. I'm really, really excited because I've never um, done drag ever, ever. Ever? So this my, never. It's my first time. Alright, so we just got back and put in some blue contacts and it took us like 30 minutes, like four layers and then he glued down the sides too. Mm -hmm. So we're ready to start finally. <laughs> Yay! Finally! I'm excited. Just dusting off the powder. Mm -hmm. I'm doing drag for two years now. Nice. But I do it like once a week, so I guess, I don't know if that counts. <laughs> that counts. So why did you start doing drag? I just, just wanted to like to do it just just to do it, you know. Mm -hmm. No like particular reason. Mm -hmm. So one day I just you know bought a bodysuit, mm -hmm. a wig, and then just head to the club. I won my first competition. It was like talent night. Yeah. And I came in and I was like didn't know nobody. What did you do for your talent? Huh? It was. Just, so it was like a free for all kind of thing. Mm -hmm. So then you come in with a song and then you perform, uh, and then the crowd's reaction, mm -hmm. like whoever gets like the most applaud, is like the winner. Mm -mm -mm. So, do you talk? On no, no, you don't. I just I'm a smasher. <laughs> <laughs> What's your like must have products for? Drag? Uh, probably Krylon, this paint stick right here, because. Mm -hmm. It has full coverage. Mm. It stays on. I look like an alien. Oh, you're gonna look. Screenshot. 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 I think Doug is the one of the only people that like have thick brows like me. Like thick. With a C. Thick. 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 Honestly, like I think oh, Jesus. my subscribers teach me more lingo <laughs> than any other um, outlet. I actually really like Aja. She's so She's funny. She's funny. Yeah. Her reactions are... Everything. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. You don't love me. You don't love me. And you don't love me. Oh. Yeah, I think like, towards the end, I... Ajahn Far Farah was boring. Until the end, I... Yeah. yeah, I feel like that personality showed a little bit more. It was really funny. There was this one video of Farah just like, whining the whole... The whole time. Yeah. <laughs> It was everywhere. Oh. Honestly, cold. Yeah, it's really fun. I met her, she's so sweet though. Yeah. She looks really cute. Mm -hmm. She only needs like chapstick yeah. and mascara to be in drag. Yeah, she's a pretty boy. She oh. used. Oh. oh, yeah. I like it. <laughs> That's as good. <laughs> like, literally, like, you know how, like, when you go into, like, downward lighting at a restaurant mm -hmm. and you can see everyone's texture mm -hmm. he has no texture that's how good his skin is i have some pores in i have some pores like there's they're like right in yeah, this there's one pores. area no no i said you a drink <laughs> <laughs> yeah that finale was they, they were like y'all so thought wild. this was i know rupaul's best friend race mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Y'all wanted a twist day? So, you're from Texas, right? I'm from Vietnam originally. Oh, he's from Vietnam originally, my bad. <laughs> he lives in Texas. <laughs> um, how's it like being a drag queen there? Um, it's very different. Cause, um, over there is more pageant. So, mm. pageant is very, very popular over there. Mm. So, um, it's more of just like, it's not really like, your look, it mm -hmm. of course your look matters, mm -hmm. but it's more of like performance wise. Mm -hmm. And if you can perform and if you have like charisma, you can turn a crowd, you can do anything. Mm -hmm. How would you say the LA drag scene is like? It's a lot different. Mm -hmm. Everyone's very independent. Mm -hmm. Over there, it's a lot of families, like drag families. I see. I don't know, it just, I'm, it's a southern hospitality or mm -hmm. something. 
I really like a like a dark eye and then a dark lip. Mm. That's probably my favorite one. It's a light, light, lighter skin mm. contrast. Yeah. yeah. I know I haven't done. I'm not really adventurous with my makeup. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't say it just has been like evolved over the years, mm -hmm. like slowly finding. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's with like not just drag queens but everybody. Usually, yeah, like, people slowly find their aesthetic, mm -hmm. and then like even when they find it, they constantly change it, modify it, mm -hmm. perfect it. Such a woman. Oh, she's she's feeling she's feeling herself. I'm gonna put more chapstick. So, how did you learn to do makeup? It's just like experimenting, pretty much. Practice, see, practice, yeah, seeing what works, mm -hmm. seeing what doesn't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love it. It's very therapeutic for me. Yeah, yeah, makeup. Mm -hmm. Just find it so it's such a personal thing. Oh my gosh. I feel like with my makeup looks, I tend to think of it as more like watercolor rather than clean lines that much. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. I noticed that too. Yeah, I don't really love. So is this uh, base set proof? Yeah, we're gonna bake you. Okay, cool. We're gonna throw you in the oven. Yeah, I've never been baked before. Out. So you don't apply primer? Mm -mm. Mm. I somehow put on powder, like I said. Mm. Oh, I love it. It's like real life Photoshop. Mm -hmm. Basically, what we're doing. Okay, face me. This is the important part. The nose. I thought about having a nose job a long time. But again, it's like, it seems like it would be painful. And also, I'm scared to touch it. The recovery time is. Yeah. That's what I'm scared about. Yeah. Did you ever have like eating disorders? Mmm, I was really fat. That's it. See. Yeah. I used. I was. in bulimic for about six months. Are you yeah. kidding? You could see my spine and like my ribs. Yeah. I would. Like recently, in the past like two years, I've been like working out more and having a, a more healthy relationship with food. Mm -hmm. But it's still hard. I feel like I still struggle with that in terms of like when I eat, mm -hmm. um, I, I, uh, I feel guilty about eating. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Y'all see it? Ivan doesn't have a bottom half, but his bottom half is... is I, He's very fit. I have a bottom half, guys. It might be hard to believe, mm. but he does. So what has like drag taught you in uh, life? In life, like, just to, like, I think just to not take things so seriously all the time. You know, life is about having fun. Mm -hmm. If you enjoy what you're doing, mm -hmm. you have a good time doing it, keep doing it. Don't think about what others are doing. Mm -hmm. Don't make it too too like serious either. Yeah. Have you dated drag queens? Mm -mm. Oh, thought that would be a story. I know. No, I'm really boring. Mm. So when you're in drag, can people tell that you're Asian? No. No, right? Mm -mm. Yes. Prominent double eyelids too. So I try to do one of your makeup tutorials and like uh, I just like because you go like into your crease with like oh, yeah. the pink and yeah. then I did that and then I opened my eyes and I looked like a punch. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm just like fuck this is not working out. Uh, I used to like really dislike my like monolith. No, I love it. I wish I had it. Really? Yes. What language do you speak? Vietnamese and English. Mm. Is she snatch? Yeah, love it. Also, I don't think I've ever had my makeup done, ever. This is my first time. 
Oh my god, yeah. We're, we are breaking things, we are yeah. trying new things, exploring, exploring. New oh my gosh, They're breaking down boundaries. Yeah. Can you do that? Almost there. For <laughs> okay. 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 Look up for me. I also don't bake ever. Ever. I mean, you don't need to. Your skin is so good. What does baking do it's for you? It's like this style of makeup. Basically, mm -hmm. it's required a lot of liquid mm -hmm. and creams. Like creams. And. Uh, other like uh, emollient product mm -hmm. therefore baking just it just seeps through and just sets it uh-huh so by having like a large amount of powder on top it just seeps through the foundation and mm -hmm. set it can you eat and drag yeah Ooh. I do that all the time what do you eat I eat everything there's no limitation mm -hmm. how do you come up with your drag name I was watching My Little Pony. Um, <laughs> there was as a, one does. As one does on a normal day. Mm -hmm. um, and there was this one pony. Her name was Diamond Tiara. Huh, and she cute. was, yeah, she was like the head bitch, mm -hmm. basically. Mm -hmm. So I was like, damn, that's me. Like, no, they're all like the other drag queens, they all have diamond in their name somehow, mm -hmm. some way. So I was just like, girl, I don't want to. I want to be an OG mm -hmm. and plastic, plastic is kind of like plastic mm -hmm. at the same time so I would just like Dude, it looks so good Oh yeah? I love it Stop, keep lining it please No, it looks, it looks really good How long do you take to get ready before a show every day? Um, around like just makeup mm -hmm. Just makeup is like two hours what about everything else? Everything else take about another hour. So mm -hmm. three hours. I used to get oh my like God. hair or like clothing. You mean? Yeah, like pads. Oh, how do you pad? That's an interesting. Oh my gosh! I, oh, I should have brought my pads. It's <laughs> basically a mattress. Oh. I can take it out and sleep on it if needed. Nice. That's basically what I do in the parking lot waiting for my Uber. Use. When I say my Airbnb, I meant like uh, my hip pads. <laughs> the club down the street. <laughs> <laughs> In the parking lot. Yeah, in, in the parking lot. Brown. Yeah. We're doing brown eyeshadow. It's gonna be very, warm, very natural. Peachy. Wonder. Peachy natural. Peachy natural. Living her life. Mm -hmm. I've never worked with your eye shape before, so this is gonna be an adventure. Mm -hmm. I want you to create a totally different eye shape. Oh, Just it's gonna do happen. whatever with me. Oh, oh, it's gonna look good. Yay. How did your parents react when you first started doing drag? Horribly. Mm -hmm. They were just like, what the fuck? Are they uh, better now? Um, in. in no, well, no. we don't really talk about it. Do you do makeup at home or do you go somewhere to do it? Do I do makeup at home. I just run out the door really quick. <laughs> oh, yeah. One day they'll understand. Mm -hmm. I think so too. It just takes time. Yeah. What brand shadows are these? These are like a combination of like Makeup Forever, Blend Prime. Mm -hmm. But I do like what like Drag Race made it like more normal, I guess, to mm -hmm. to want to be a drag queen. And stuff. I think so. It's a little bit like they do have like some good segments about like coming out and educating people. You're right. So I do like that aspect of it. I do too. Because I feel like those stories might be um, more common to us, mm -hmm. but not to like... The say, younger generation. Yeah, and like Middle America and mm -hmm. and parts other parts of the world that watch it. Because in LA it's so common mm -hmm. that people don't really bat an eye. Yeah, if you tell them that you're queer or anything, mm -hmm. you know. So here's what the eyeshadow looks like at the moment. Um, yeah, it looks really good. What is it? Stila, right? Mm-hmm, I love this stuff. The Stila, what is it called? The liquid eye metals. The liquid eye metals. Yeah, I saw so much like 
hype on these. They're so shiny. They are so... Oh my god, they're everything. Do you want me to keep my eyes closed for me? Yes, please do. Oh! Yes. Oh! Yes. Oh! That's pigmented. That's a woman. It's so black. Okay. I feel like... I'm confident now. As we progress and more, my voice starts... <laughs> changing! Oh. I want to be a whiny queen. Oh, no. Yeah. I can't wait for lashes to go on. Yeah, girl. <laughs> so do you do like a liquid liner or you just use a shadow to shadow off the line? I use a shadow and then I go in with a liquid liner for the lash line. Mm. So do you have like a drag family? Yeah, this is my... Lisa Edwards, she's my um, drag mom. Mm. She adopted me like a year ago. Mm. Yeah. The funny thing is, she's like actually like the same person in on TV life. and in real life. She's funny. Like, there's she has a very good personality. Mm -hmm. I feel the need to like drink louder when I <laughs> when I have this on. I was like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm um using like the corresponding color on top and then mm -hmm. lining it at the bottom line not a lash line mm -hmm. okay lashes Ooh. this is gonna be the fun part there we go anyway whoa crazy that's a I love it that's a one whoa 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 that's a woman Mm -mm. Yeah, I love how soft everything is. It's crazy. You're so good. I'm so excited. Ooh. I can see how like drag would like bring out oh, girl. like a lot in you. That feels okay. Yeah, feels feels normal. She's ooh. She's She's supposed to be, okay. Right. Set her in there. So he just did my brows and we used, he used the, the, the Kryolan stick, right? Mm -hmm. To, um, like clean it up underneath. Mm -hmm. and, and then, then I used, used the powder mm -hmm. to do it. Oh my gosh, so good. This is uh, everything. Dude, I don't even have to raise my brows. Like, mm -mm. it's already raised. I love it. What's the filter? I don't know her. No filter. I've I never know. used a filter. I don't know her. Look at I her, though. I've never Ooh. used face too. I've never used Photoshop. Who is she? Legend, that's what I thought. In my <laughs> so Mulan. Wow. wow. Magic test. If you have like good skin in me. Oh. 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 Yeah, that looks so good. Mm -hmm. That's the one the news. Ooh, when I open my eyes, like it opens even bigger. Yep. It's me. I look like him. It's yeah. me. Him it's me. Back. We're sisters. And red M&M's. Where's my red m and <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. I feel like bottom lashes are a trend now. Like, mm -hmm. No, I used to be like, oh my god, now I don't like it. But now no. it's like, no, it's everything. I love it. Oh my god. You're so talented. Oh my gosh. So much talent. Who are you? She's here stealing my gig. I don't know why I did this. I just wanna I just wanna take like a million selfies. She all forced day. me to do this. Ah, yeah, this ah, is my angle, like ah, right here. Ah! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> How do you eat in this? Like I tie it back like a real woman. And then your lip, you like how do you just like don't touch the lip color. No, I just I just let it go. Oh. <laughs> the illusion is over by then. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. He's so talented. So if you want to see like his looks, he like does a lot of like very beautiful looks on his Instagram. Go check it out. 
I love it. I can't stop looking at myself. You look amazing. I'm gonna take like 10,000 selfies. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, guys. We had a lot of fun. Thank you so much. Thank looked. you for having me. Yeah, of honored. Course. Honored. Thank you. All right. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye. So I took the lashes off and my wig off. He looked kind of angry and crazy, but um, Duck is so talented. He was really, really soft with like the whole application, so it was really cool. Honestly, for me, I really love like experiencing other people's art and um, learning from other people's art because as a person you can only learn you can only can keep learning so yeah I'm gonna use a cleansing oil to see how this makeup breaks down really I'm just gonna use my soft demo Kose cleansing oil ooh so yeah. alright I'm gonna wash off and shower and I'll see you guys in my next video guys Thanks for watching. Bye.